Hey everybody, it's Lorenzo from GamesRadar.com and I'm checking out Defiance and I'm here with... I'm Bill Trost, the creative lead for Defiance. Alright, so it uh, looks like we've jumped into a game of uh, multiplayer here. Can you tell us a little bit about the game, give us a little run through of uh, what Defiance is all about and uh, what we're playing and what we're seeing? Sure, Defiance is a huge online competitive and co cooperative shooter. Uh, you're in a gigantic seamless world with thousands of other players. Right now what we're seeing here is, uh, is sh a Shadow War, which is one of our uh, competitive modes that can break out at any time in the, over the huge seamless world. So as you're running through the game, doing missions uh, with your buddies, you can queue up for a Shadow War and as enough players are interested in it, they break out and the basic gameplay is uh, you know, ca capture and hold. Uh, so there's various points throughout the world and, and uh, you can see uh, Tony here is riding his quad over to to one of those points. Right, so I, I played a little bit of the uh, cooperative part of it, and uh, so there's a definite MMO elements in there. There's people okay. running around, uh, you, you pick up loot, can you go into that a little bit? Sure, yeah, it's, it's, you know, it's a huge seamless world. The, the, the key thing about Defiance is that it, it's, it's an online persistent game, so there's thousands of other people you can be playing in your co-op mode and 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 one of then immediately go into these competitive modes and all the loot all the experience and character progression that you earn in your co-op play or in your competitive play transfer over into both you know you're never you know, there's it's not like there's two separate games you know we've broken down the barriers there and and your character all of the progression all of the cool loot that you got you can take you know take all that stuff that you earn in co-op play you can take immediately into competitive play and and use it against your friends Cool. Uh, so, can you tell us a little bit about the character classes and how the character progresses as you go through the story? Sure. Actually, we you know, Defiance is, is pretty freeform. We're, we're a class-free system, so you know, the, you're you're able to totally define your character based off the types of gameplay that you want. You know, you're able to have equipped. Uh, two weapons at a given time as well as a grenade and shield and then there's uh, special abilities that we call ego powers and ego perks that you can have and through the combination of all of those things you can kind of define your role within any engagement and you can save those off as a loadout and and have multiples of those and so as you're playing the game you know you might have one particular loadout that's really that you really like to use in cooperative play or when you're doing one of our you know co-op maps which are you know smaller four player instanced experiences and then, you know, a shadow war breaks out and you're like, oh, I got to switch to my sniper. And you can instantly do that. So, you, you know, we want to make sure players never feel like they're made some commitment and that they're locked to one particular play style. Cool. Can you talk a little bit about the uh, social aspect? Can uh, players make clans? Can they, you know, how, how do they group up and what, uh, what do they do, like the instances and that kind of thing? Yeah, you can have up to, up to four players within a, within a cooperative instance. Uh, we have multiplayer... Uh, both the, the, the Shadow War, which is, you know, and uh, really an unlimited number of players based off who's, in, who's involved. And then uh, we have uh, instance battlefields, which can be up to 16. 16 on 16 is our biggest. 16 on 16. Um, and uh, and then uh, there, there we, we, we do have plans. Um, uh, and so Defiance is based off of uh, the TV show that's upcoming. And, uh, sure. Yeah, it's not so much that it's, that it's based off a TV show, and that it's that we were that both things were developed at the same time, and uh, from the very beginning, it was a co partnership between Tryon and Sci-Fi to develop this new Sci-Fi world that that we would build a new TV, brand new TV show, a brand new online. Uh, game and that the, that both things would be like two windows into this brand new sci-fi universe and that that a player uh, or a viewer who participates in both would have a richer experience because they're getting insight into you know a deeper insight into either the show or the game depending on which on which window they're looking through at the time um, but at the same time I don't want it, you know I don't want to imply that you have to do both you know if you're just into if you're just into it for to, uh, just a video gamer and you don't really care about the television show you can t the game totally stands on its own and can be a, a completely rewarding and com uh, complete experience just the same as the TV show if, if you know if you're if you're not a gamer and you just like episodic TV you can just watch the TV show and, and it's awesome you know sci-fi TV but if you do if you if you are a you know that, that type of person who's a super fan and wants to wants to get you know every nook and cranny of the Defiance world, then you know you'll do both. And and we have lots of cool things, both subtle and pretty big things that that tie the two things together, and and will make that you know an even bigger experience. 
How will the the content uh, go along with the, 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 TV the, the TV show? Yeah, the series. Yeah. So so like over the course of season one, you know, there's there's very uh, specific events and and things that we have uh, that will uh, either have you know cause and effect between the show and the game and, and back and forth or things like a character from the game moving into the TV show or and or character from the TV show moving into the game um, and actually we start off the season with it with a experience like that where the game is coming out on April 2nd and the show premieres two weeks later um, for a uh, when the game launches, you're like, you actually, right within the first couple of minutes, you, you, you're introduced to the two main characters of the television show. And they're in the game world, you can go on adventures with them, and as that particular storyline wraps up within the, within the game, it leads directly into where those characters are at the very beginning of the premiere of the TV show. Sounds awesome. So when can uh, everybody get, in, get their hands on the game, and what, for what platforms? Uh, Defiance launches April 2nd of this year, and it's going to be on PC, Xbox 360, and PlayStation 3. Awesome. So for more on Defiance, check out gamesradar.com. Damn it! I'm dying here!